A report summoned by more than 85 experts over 30 years produced one clear link between computers and children's learning. Computer ain't good for us because it rots your mind and running is good for you and and um, we have pop now. It's not good for you. What does creativity mean to you? Mm. Um, expression of oneself's inner feelings. Originality and being yourself, not uh, you know, creating something that you like and not really caring what others think of it. A 1995 analysis by the College Board showed that students who studied the arts for more than four years scored 44 points higher on the math portion and 59 points higher on the verbal section of the SAT. Nonetheless, over the past decade, one third of the nation's public school music programs were dropped. During the same period, annual spending on school technology tripled to $6.2 billion. We didn't need to buy that, we could have saved some money. Creativity to me is probably just coming up with your own stuff and just sticking with it, not, not being unoriginal. Keep going. Funds and time needed for purchasing and maintaining computers drains resources from proven school essentials such as smaller classroom sizes, arts and music programs, and physical education. They have many opportunities to apply mental representations of the world to new objects, people, and situations. The key ability for future academic learning. They integrate all types of learning, physical, social, emotional, intellectual, and language development. They are engaged in things they are interested in so they have a natural motivation to learn. For a very special reason. Everything I think is a special reason. You can't let any reason that you think of not be special, okay? Hey Ryan, what's the special reason? It's taking an old idea and putting a new spin on it, changing it in some way. Well, I'm a dancer, so when I think about creativity, I think about expression through movement, and you can make dance anything you want, so I express my creativity through movement in dance. When the time is yours, the future is waiting, the person you become, the people you're creating. As teachers, especially at the elementary level, it is our job to help facilitate play with responsive interactions with our children, based on the understanding of how play contributes to academic and social learning. Take your kids on a walk through campus to enjoy the more than 30 monumental sculptures. Make sure to ask them open-ended questions about their surroundings. Nature stimulates all the senses and encourages imaginative play. While you're on campus, check out the Sheldon Memorial Art Gallery, which contains more than 12,000 pieces in its permanent collection and are routinely rotated with approximately 12 traveling exhibits stopping in Lincoln each year. Here are some things you can do and places you can go. The Children's Museum, the Luck Center for Arts, 
the First Friday Art Walks, the Lead Centre for Fine and Performing Arts, the Children's Zoo. The weekend has over 100 parks and miles and miles of bike trails. <coughs> Check out Paint Yourself Silly. Check out the paper for Weekend Family Fun Fests. Brave, courageous. And why do you need this activator in your... Thank you.